Hello everyone, Kitty King TV here, and today we are going to be talking about kind of uh, our expectations for Lost Ark, what I'm planning on doing, um, everything I'm excited about, and uh, yeah, so let's get into it. Um, as you guys know, Lost Ark comes out and releases on February 11th, and that'll be February 8th if you bought the Founders Pack or a... Um, a uh, bronze, silver, gold, or platinum crate off of Steam. Um, I went ahead and I purchased the bronze crate because I think that's just the best deal for me. And uh, getting to play that three days early, um, you know, is, is definitely uh, worth it in my opinion. So, yeah, I'm super excited. This is going to be my first time playing Lost Ark. I've, um, un unlike a lot of other people that, uh, are already interested in it or have already played it i haven't played on the russian servers or the korean servers so like many of you uh this will be my first time you know diving in and digging into it um i'm super excited to uh really dig down and uh get to get to see what all this game has to offer because i've been obsessed with this game the past week and i haven't even played it <laughs> it's it's actually crazy i'm actually so excited for lost ark um i actually at first when i seen it and i realized it was getting a release um it, or it was already released in other uh, uh other countries i wasn't as excited but the closer it's been getting the more and more excited i've been getting to uh want to play it so super excited for that um one of the biggest things I'm looking forward to is seeing that in-game raiding content and dungeons. It actually has a lot more to offer than I expected, and I was not uh, I was not expecting some of the um, uh, complexity and you know uh, uh, you know hardcore aspect in like the in-game raids and stuff. I wasn't seeing that, uh, or I wasn't I wasn't expecting that. And then you know just the more research I've done and the more I've seen into it, I, it definitely has a, a bit to offer, which I think is cool. So I can't wait till more and more content releases and we get to do more and more pve stuff but i think the biggest thing i'm excited for is definitely going to be the pvp i haven't played a good pvp mmo um you know based mmo in a while i didn't even know they had like open world pvp so i'm excited for a lot of this stuff you got the open world pvp and then you got the rank pvp the arenas look absolutely sick it looks absolutely devastating so i can't wait to get in there and give that a shot um that's probably going to be something I'm going to be focusing on the most. I'm going to definitely be grinding out those ranks and trying to get good in that uh, in that PvP aspect. Um, another thing uh, that I am also planning on doing once I get in is, uh, well, I, I plan on playing a Deathblade, but from what I learned, a lot of people keep telling you just try multiple classes, try a lot of classes, um, give everything a shot. So, you know, I might, I might dabble around. The Gunslinger looks pretty cool, cool, the female Gunslinger, so I might give that a shot. Um, but right now, Deathblade is looking the most interesting to me. Shadowhunter seems pretty cool, too. But um, there there are a couple aspects of it that I, I'm not interested in. Um, right now, Deathblade's looking like the style I want to go into. That uh, Assassin DPS, uh, it's looking, looking pretty cool. Um, uh, another thing I'm planning to do once I get into Lost Ark is uh, I want to try and start a guild. You know, um, I haven't had a good, you know, big guild going in quite some time not since blessed online have i actually been part of like a uh community like big guild and, and it was owned by me so i'm gonna go ahead and uh try and launch one um uh, as soon as the servers start um it's gonna be open to everybody you know people who pvp pve who like to craft casual hardcore it's going to be open to everybody we're just gonna try and build like a big guild community and uh see how that goes um you know hopefully hopefully it goes well but if if I'm too busy doing hardcore content or, or um, you know, speeding through the game uh, to manage, then I'll guess I'll just try and join like a, another guild that's um, you know that has the same interest as me or whatnot. But uh, I'm, I'm definitely going to try and start one up as soon as uh, release drops. Um, when the game does uh, initially drop on the eighth, I'm going to play the heck out of it. I'm talking about. 24 hours pure grinding i want to play at a casually good speed you know um uh, i typically go through things pretty fast um uh so i'm gonna play it at like my own pace but it's i you know i, I probably won't skip all the cutscenes, but uh, dialogue and things along those lines i'll probably just skim through or cut through really fast um and just play it at a nice uh leisurely pace that i like to play at um 
because I already played Endwalker and I sped through that as fast as possible. And, uh, you know, uh, next day I was already done with everything. <laughs> so I think uh, since this is my first time in Lost Ark, um, to really get to know everything and uh, get immersed in the world, I might slow it down just a tad bit. But uh, I still will be playing all day on release and I do plan on uh, reaching that level cap or that in-game max level um, within one to two days. So... Um, still relatively fast um, and uh, yeah that's those are kind of just kind of the things that I'm looking forward to that I'm excited about a lot of it looks like there's a lot of things to learn in Lost Ark but you know I'm excited to go ahead and give it a shot um, yeah other than that I just wanted to give a little update I hope uh, you know to see all of you in Lost Ark as well if any of you guys want to join my guild or come um, uh, hang out play do some PvP some rating you know stop by my twitch stream twitch.tv slash kitty king tv um and you know we could work something out but uh i will see you guys soon in lost ark um and yeah talk to you guys later peace